this Christmas. We just bought the house two doors down. Nothing brings family together like kids. Can I go climb that rock wall? Yeah. You can have a double dose of Fokker in him. What does that mean? <laughs> double dose. Little Fockers. Rated PG-13. Q102 and Express bring you Jingle Ball 2010. On your feet! Let's get it started! How you guys doing? Oh, oh my goodness, I, dude, I, I don't know what to, to say. I like the bow tie. Uh, thank you, I appreciate yeah. that, man. Uh, and that's a compliment coming from Jesse McCartney backstage <laughs> at the Q102 Jingle Ball. Yeah, What's man. up, bro? I've been well. I've yeah. been well, just been working. Yes, Got a new man. album coming out in the new year. Tell us about it. Have dude. it all. It's the new my fourth studio album. Okay, and I remember last time we had a chance, a, a chance to chat, you weren't quite uh, going to disclose the album title. Yeah, well, we've, we've, we've chosen the title. Have it all is one of the, uh, the songs on the record. Uh-huh. And uh, yeah, it sort of sums up kind of my life. I really feel like at this point, you want it all, dude. You, I want it all. I feel like I really do have it all. I have an amazing uh, group of fans that yeah, have showed man. up to the show, and it, it doesn't. It's it's always rad, right? I mean, whatever you go, whatever city you touch down in, man. How does it feel to either just take the stage or or walk through the mall and be like just adored by so many? People. I live for it, man. Yeah. You know, it's it never gets old, and mm -hmm. it's one of those one of those things when you walk in, and it, it's sort of an overwhelming feeling. And yeah. to, to to stand on stage, and sing a song, and everyone knows the lyrics to one of your records yes. that you've written. Um, it's a pretty unbelievable feeling, and it you know I've been doing it now for seven years, and I'm still. Does it seem like it's that long, or is it like one of those kind of things that just kind of flashes by, man? Like, do it you remember, like, right now, by. like, you know, like, the Summerland days? Like, could you go back and be like, dude, I remember that? Yeah, I mean, it happened so, so quickly. Yeah. You know, I remember being on stage, I think it was here even a couple of years ago. It just goes by like that. Well, and you deserve it all, bro. Thanks, man. I mean, congrats. Thank you. Um, now, are there any are there any more you know songwriting tricks that you still got hidden up your sleeve? Are you still you know uh, utilizing that part of your brain to help out other upcoming artists? Absolutely. I've been in the studio working a lot with uh, some great writers. One of which you guys know, Kevin Rudolph. Oh, dude, yeah. Who's uh, become a real close cool. buddy of mine, and uh, he's an amazing writer producer. And he and I've been writing some records for some for some artists. All right, all right. And uh, you know, we're I'm actually also I've been in the studio in the last month or so I've written a few more songs that have been uh have made some noise okay. in my camp and we're thinking about maybe putting a few more on on this album before we release it and in the new year. Well, dude, so. now that we get all the, the, the business out the way, dude, I just want to say happy holidays. And, and you too, have, man. We have some gifts, dude. We have a couple of gifts left. Okay. We've been, uh, you know, been able to do some really awesome things for some people. Cool. And, um, dude, Flo Rida, he's like 6'3", 240 pounds. Uh -huh. And he muscled me out of your gift. Oh. So you get his gift. <laughs> what, right? what gift did he get? Well, we, 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 what was, did you give him? I got, I got it kind of for you, but he took it because it came, it was a shake weight, dude. It was a sh of course. You, you, you see, how appropriate. How appropriate, yeah, right? But now yeah. yours, I think you're gonna have a little bit more fun. All so right. don't mind the fact that it's, it you can see that it says to flow rider from yeah. Max, but dude, like cool. every bit is every bit right. of it's of not me a puzzle of like the, the no, Florida yeah. State. No, not at all. Okay, dude. it makes sense. Well, have me, all I'll, right. I'll, I'll you the mic. take the mic. Yeah, dude. So go ahead, rip into. It. I just I want to get you something fun, dude. Something that you can just like rally up with the homies and go all, right. all the way with it. Little there you guy. go, dude. All right. Nerf or nothing. Nerf or nothing, right? Nerf you see what nothing. I'm saying, dude? So glow it, in the dark. And it glows in the dark, dude. You know, I mean? love so it. Late nights in the studio hanging out with the I, love, I grew man. up with Nerf, man. I had the Nerf footballs, the Nerf baseballs. I, I used to... This is like a childhood... Uh, this is nostalgic right well, here. Well, there you have it, dude. For me go. to you, for everyone here at Q, man, we really appreciate My you man, being here. My man, thank you so Ball. much. This, ladies and gentlemen, is Mr. Jesse McCartney. Yeah, man, he's rad. Thanks. Thanks <laughs> a lot, man. Appreciate it. Right on. Q102 and Express bring you Jingle Ball 2010. On your feet! Let's get it started!